Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to the pink Konoplyanka run of the tournament. Kind of sounds long-winded, but basically what it is, is the footies cup. I've kind of left it a long time. We still have 10 attempts, but we have one day to uh, complete it. Now, first win is Konoplyanka. Uh, I think he's 86 rated. And then you get a Bamiang, which is 89, I think think and then Royce which is 91 now obviously I'd love to win all of them but it's most probably not uh, gonna happen so I would love just Konoplyanka and uh, Aubameyang if I can now this is the team I'm running with it's not too expensive so anyone can obviously build it just the benches some backup pacey players some defensive players and a couple of backup strikers but in goal we've got uh, Moya Two centre-backs, Mustafi and Varane. The Marcos, Felipe Luis on the uh, wing-backs. And then we got Rakitic, Kwachowiak and Isco playing the midfield with Nyaki Williams and Conor Plyanka up top. And then we have my man Alexandra Pato playing the strike role. Recently moved from Chelsea. Uh, kind of disappointed about that. Would have loved him to stay at Chelsea. But what can you do? We're going to jump into the first game and hopefully... We can uh, find a decent opponent, not too crazy good, because I'm hoping I can make it to the finals and win it first try, maybe even the second try. Right, let's see what type of team this guy is uh, rocking with. Hoping, I'm hoping it's not too uh, crazy amazing, but I never know because you face so many sweaty people with this. Wow, actually that's the first legend I've come against. I've never seen a legend in uh, FIFA so far. Doesn't look like he's won it because he's still playing with the 82 uh, Conan Plyanka, but three at the back. He also doesn't have full chemistry on some of his players, which could hurt him since they uh, changed the whole chemistry thing with like new players like transferred or position change players and whatnot. That's one. Yes. Inyaki Williams. Even though it's lagging, I still manage just to keep it simple. Run down the side, cut in a few times, smash it home. One nil up. He's not looking too great, this guy. So, I'm, I'm calling it a win so far. Well, that was unexpected. Um, we're through already. Like, he just quit. I'm hoping then. Next game, obviously we've gone through, uh, isn't as laggy because that was... It was becoming unbearable. Like, I'd be running down the wing. I'd go to chop in or whatnot. My guy would continue running, go out of play, and then chop in. But we got the first win. We need three more for uh, Krychowiak. Right. Next opponent. Hopefully, he's just like the uh, last opponent and uh, isn't as good, doesn't have a good team. Well, okay. A lot of pace at the back. Bamiang. That's not even a Bamiang, is it? It's a Kore and a Bonner. And then he's got Sterling, Sturridge, a Turbe and Klein. Decent team. I'm hoping he's not going to be uh, a great opponent because I myself would love to win this tournament. Try to get that uh, 86 Konoplyanka and I'm hoping the connection is good. I can't bear another laggy-ish game. Oh, Rev. It's a little bit laggy. I don't know. Where, I don't think it's me. Yes. Oh, you beauty. That is how you score the first goal. Now, that is how you open the. Like, I didn't expect to go in the the keeper. The keeper should have had that three minutes racked. I don't score free kicks. So I'm actually surprised myself. How is this guy so deadly down the wing? Like, he literally... I can't do anything because I turn base so fucking small and agile. Like, every time he turns, I can't touch him. And then Inla, apparently is a fucking tank. And, like, when I go to tackle him, he just gets it back instantly. Well, first half, uh... It's pretty even, but... I don't know, man. I don't know if I'm liking this at the minute. There 
it's kind of this team's kind of slow to react to everything um i'm tempted to bring on tiago for rakitic just because I, I i feel rakitic is good but he's just not doing it for me at the minute Oh word, um, how does that happen? The goalkeepers like dive so fucking early. This was, I don't know, I don't, look at that. I, d I just don't know what that was, but I'm not complaining, I'm gonna I'm a take that. Oh, yes, no, what is going on? Jesus Christ. Boys, literally, we could have had a third then. Wow. We're coming into the dying minutes of the game, and this guy's got a fucking attack. He has gone, like, I swear, all-out attack. But at the same time, altered the fence here. Oh, Pato. Blow the fucking whistle, Rare. Blow the whistle. Oh, no, don't blow the whistle. Well, that was bollocks. It went through his legs. I tried to do the early cross, but nevertheless, we have got the second win to put us through to the semi-finals. Do I think I deserve that win? Most probably not. But we're getting it anyway. I did get kind of lucky with the, the first goal being that I actually scored a fucking free kick. Actually, no, looking at the stats, he didn't have many shots. But anyway, that for today's episode... Or this part, should I say, is where I'm going to end it on two wins. Hopefully when I come back tomorrow, or later actually, because we got one day to uh, try it, we're going to win two more, maybe even six more. I don't know, but till next time.